Hey guys, thank you so much for watching. Today we are going to put together this Vigo tomato rolling self-watering planter. Now you don't only have to plant tomatoes in this. You can plant anything that you want in this container, but it's self-watering, which is awesome. And it's on wheels, which makes it so easy to move around. So let's go ahead and get this planter put together so you can see exactly what it looks like. So someone brought it to my attention that I am saying the name of this brand incorrectly and the way that I've been saying it, I've been saying it for years so I, no one's ever corrected me and I thought I was saying it, it the right way. So correct me if I'm wrong, I have been saying Vego and someone told me that, told me that it's Vigo. Vigo Garden. So I apologize if I've been saying it wrong. Um, someone in the comment section tell me, is it Vigo or Vego? I happen to really have grown fond of saying Vego because that's what I've been saying forever, but you guys let me know. So I love the color of this self-watering planter. It is so beautiful. Look. Ah. Isn't that gorgeous? That is such a pretty green. I have so many planters that are like terracotta or brown or black and it is so lovely to have something that is a different color. So we've got our pieces for our trellis right here. Our water measuring gauge is right here. Overall, this looks like a simple planter to put together. So let's check this out. We've got some instructions for the trellis. This planter comes in two pieces. So you've got your water basin here, and then you've got your actual planter here. Your soil will suck up the water that meets this level. So any water that's here will get sucked up into the soil and that water level can actually go pretty high but you probably don't want to have your container just so full of water because eventually that will soak your soil completely and you don't want oversaturated soil so just be mindful of how much water you put in there and you'll know by the gauge so the gauge tells you if you need to refill or if the uh self-watering planter is full so be mindful of that you can still overwater in self-watering containers when you ignore this here so let's see it's like this goes here pop it into this hole right there easy this looks like where you can pour the water in right in that hole all right, let's pop this baby out and let's get this trellis built. This is labeled as a tomato planter, but it has a trellis on it. You can pretty much plant anything climbing in it if you like. If you don't want to use it with the trellis or you don't have to, um, this is just a gorgeous planter on its own. So definitely try it with your tomatoes also try it with your cucumbers try it with your squash anything that requires trellising you can give this planter a try for sure so we've got our wheels
So full disclosure, Bago sent this tomato planter out to me to try and to share with you guys and see what I thought. And I'm not gonna be able to plant in it right now just because it's so early in the season, but they do have a line of seedlings out now. So they have seedlings that you can buy online and have shipped to your home, it's awesome. I have some of the ceilings and I'll share with you a clip of the unboxing. So definitely check out Vigo Gardens for seedlings. They have a nice variety up there for you to choose from. If you are not a seed starter like me, that is perfectly fine. There are so many places where you can get seedlings from and Vigo has some that you can check out. So now we are almost done. We just need to put the top on and this container is ready to plant. And again, it's a little bit early for me to plant tomatoes. We will have another video planting this up probably in May. We are almost done. Just adding the last part to this tomato planter. This is such a cute planter. Um, I love the fact that it rolls, that you can move it around easily. It's a great size, perfect for anyone who's patio gardening, gardening on your deck. This is a really great option for you. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I will link everything that you need to check this to check this planter out um, and see if it's a right fit for you. Thank you guys so much for watching. Bye.